I I now want now you know, I I want you to hear the response that, that from both sides be, tonight. First, Mr. Mishra was contradicting you. All India level. Siddharth Nath Singh wants to come in. All India level. Mr. Vivek Gupta has a full I response to, to give. Mr. Mishra, if no. you can make it brief, and then I'm coming yeah, yeah, to Siddharth. I'm com I'm coming to you right after Mr. Mishra. No, let me ask. And, and, and right, Mr. Mishra, I, I request. No, no, no. If he if he's responding, he should also explain why in the board of board of trustees of Haldia Port there are so many people who are linked to this replay company which is opposing ABG and this was at a I, period of time when am, the UPA2 was in power. I am asking a question tonight and, 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 and gentlemen actually I will allow Mr. the rebuts and then I put the question to Vivek Gupta. Okay. First rebuts from Mr. Mishra. Go ahead. Past 30 years they have been very much there. Replay company has been there very much for last so many years. The same management. They have, they do not even have license. They have license from the customs. How these handling agents, they have been handling the, uh, the bulk uh, cargo. This all happened during the left front regime. The same thing is now going, uh, getting continued. It is what it was fortunate and that does the does not uh, run the port. It is the government in, of India. It ABG is the shipping ministry. Coming. He, and, he and in 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 his yeah, uh, yeah. ability to hit that task. It is government of India. Whether it is government of India, government the, government of India. Of the state government. My question. My question, one it minute, is, between the left and the Congress, one minute, India, please, gentlemen, government, what they said gentlemen, Mr. Mishra, please, please. I, request please. I request you, please, I request you, please, we are talking add, about yes. what has happened in Haldia. He is clueless. You are clueless. One you don't minute, know one that minute. government can, of can India is running this. Down, please, can temper school down. Siddharth Nath Singh is making a point. Yes, Siddharth. Arnab, I, generally, BJP is uh, not in agreement with Congress. We have seen in the past. But here, let me add, what Mr. Mishra is saying has been in the public domain. People had been talking in the industry of this gentleman, yes. who Mr. Mishra is referring to, of running the Haldia dock as his private property. But I'm, let me ask Mr. Mishra, and with that surprises me. You have been with the Mamta for last 15 months. You were there from uh, April 2011 till about a month, month and a half back. You never raised it. You were you raised on left you front. You have been there with the left for eight years. You at the centre, but all all, <laughs> all this all this while you have never raised these issues. Now today you are raising. The, it has been there. It's been discussed. Uh, so now you are finding a political uh, you, mileage uh, for your raising. You have been with Mamta Banerjee for eight years. You were there with us for sixteen please, months please, and three months in two thousand one. It is the BJP uh, that he has been le, le, actually when we were uh, for there, eight years. When we he was were very there, much with you. Ninety-eight please, to ninety-eight to two thousand six, except three months. So you would Mr. know Mr. much Mishra, better about Mamta Banerjee. Mr. Mishra, you are, we are getting very your, happy that your, he is not your thoughts are getting Why don't blurred. Why join you? No, let, let me no, no. say I'm your thoughts are getting blurred. We are talking about a government which was running the Haldia port the and the state time government. Time. At that what time, time Mamta was is not now responding to you, Mr. Mishra. West Bengal. At that point of time, the we, West Bengal we government was ruled by the responsibility. And who were your partners? We will not take responsibility Mr. for the illegal can I please, corruption. Can I please call a truce for a second? PIM or of the BJP. I now, the I now will Congress. put on air two individuals. But Vivek Gupta is, of the, the Trinamool Congress, one minute, Jen, one minute, just give me a second. As well as Vivek Gupta of the Trinamool well Congress as and Gurpreet Mali, which something. is the affected private company, Haldia Bulk Terminals. Gentlemen, my question goes out to you both. Mr. Gupta, when you ask a company to invest in your state, do you tell the company, Mr. Gupta, that you will have to run the company as I want? Do you tell the company, so if the company tomorrow says, I want to carry out mechanization, which is what Gurpreet Mali's company did, and uh, there was retrenchment of 275 workers, are you saying that in Mamta Banerjee's Bengal, a company will have to conduct its operations based upon the political convenience of the Trinamool Congress and its local leadership? Or people who are seen to be close to the Trinamool Congress and their local leadership. Can any business operate like that, Mr. Gupta? That question is to you tonight. Uh, uh, before I respond, I'd like, to, I'd like some small information from Mr. Mali. How exactly did he tell these 275 people that they are retrenched?
Yeah, before Mr. before Mr. I proceed would you like to, to answer respond? this question, I think it's yes. I would respond. I would respond to this, and before I actually respond to this question, I would like to put in perspective the last two years. How have they been for us in Haldia? Ever since no, 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 Mr. Mali, please, 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 please. Let, 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 no, Mr. Mali, Mr. Mali, Mr. Mali, I'm sure the last two years have been uh, very challenging for your company or whatever it is because I've been reading the business papers. I just want to right. know, as any, you know, because right. you've been addressed as top corporate right. and a lot of names, uh, positive names you've been attributed. I just want to like to know right. how does the top corporate retrench 275 people? How, what is the exact procedure to be followed when you retrench yeah. 275 people? And what you did? Versus, uh, versus what you did. Just, just be, let's, yeah. just let's pertain to that much point, right? Yeah. So I'll answer your question. So in, in following, in, in carrying out the retrenchment, we followed the labor laws of the land to the T. We did not make a single departure from the applicable and the relevant labor laws. No, 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 no. How were the laborers informed that they have been retrenched? Satisfied, Mr. Mr. Gupta. Yeah, we sent. Mr. We Gupta. Mr. Anna, Mr. Gupta, there was a decision to mechanize the board. The company did not even have the power of talking to the laborers that they were being retrenched. Let Let me answer this Thank question. You. No, Thank no, no, you, Mr. Anna, Gupta. I will not know this. No, no, no. I, 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 I have nothing to hide, and I will answer this question. The bankers are telling the laborers how they were retrenched that you have got some money in your account because you've been retrenched from the company. Yeah, that, that is something which I have also read in the press, but to set this, the record straight, that is something which is, which is not true. So for the process of retrenchment, we sent a notice to, to Calcutta Port Trust, who is the employer and to whom we are a contractor. We sent a notice to the labor unions, we, we pasted a notice at, at prominent places at Haldia, and we also sent letters to all our employees. The so-called alleged SMS which everyone is talking about was sent from the bank. And if you are aware today, any bank which you have, bank account, when you have a bank account, when money is deposited or it is uh, taken out, an SMS is sent to the account holder. So it was the SMS sent from the bank account and it, it was not something which we are responsible for. Which was the for. only information they ever got. Which was the only information they ever got. You might have, uh, you know, spoken to Haldi or whatever. Did all, you all, I say, all I can Mr. say, Gupta, all I can say to Gupta, that. Gupta, one I minute, Mr. Gupta, one minute. Now take my question. You know, you are refusing to take my question. It's a baseless My question is a company took a decision. No, no, one minute, one minute. A company took a decision in their interest to mechanize the port, right? 275 workers yeah. lost their jobs. Mr. After Gupta, that, Trinamool Congress the workers allegedly threatened the, the officials of the asking government them not of India. to start work. The, the, policy, the policy of mechanization is the policy of the government of India. It's the PPP policy, public-private policy, wherein all major posts in India have to be mechanized. It's not a policy of our company. And this was done pursuant am, to the policy of government of India. And a global tender was invited. My question to Vivek Gupta is, is Vivek Gupta, yes, the, the High Court, the no, High Court, I'm asking you a question of the it's law it's of the land, Vivek Gupta, one minute please. The, no, one minute Vivek Gupta. The, the law of the land as represented by the High Court ordered your administration to provide security to your company. Despite this, after the allegation, after the abduction on the 30th of October, Mamta Banerjee says nothing has happened. Are you going to follow the law of the land or not? Anna, the law of the land will absolutely be followed. And that is what exactly I said earlier also. If there has been an abduction taking place, they have to lodge an FIR and let, give the police or the local authority the time to investigate and take action. Instead, they are the only ones who are keen to take, uh, keen to take action. And let me say, you know, a one year old, a one year old girl was abducted. Me, like, a one year old girl was abducted, no, 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 sir. One, year, one and a half Three months, HBD uh, officials were please, abducted, please, including a one year one old girl in, in your state. Also approached Haldia dog complaint. In your state. And they said, and, and Arna, you, 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 a one year old girl is abducted. You, don't you think this, this is an extraordinary situation? Gurpreet Maji is responding to you, and Nirupma Basu also wants to come in. I'm opening up the debate tonight. Yes, Mr. Maji. And this abduction, this abduction was done after we had, this abduction was carried out after we had deposited 17 and a half lakhs with the state treasury. Because this, 
in spite of the high court only ordering us to pay the police cost, is, the district administration insisted that we should pay this money in advance. So does, do we now take that in this country we have to pay money for our protection? In reverence to your position as the anchor, I just repeat the question. Yeah, go ahead. I just, I just repeat the question which I posed in the beginning itself, that if investigation is still to take place, then why the district superintendent of police, day before yesterday in a press conference, announced that no abduction had actually taken place? That is a very fundamental question. No, Siddharth Nath Singh, let me draw you back, please. It's a fundamental the question. question. More about whether the law of the no, land please, will apply please. or not. That was the question in 2008, no, I think, I think when Ratan Tata said we faced agitation not from the government but from the opposition. Siddharth Nath Singh, your point to the Trinamool Congress. Look, Arnab, whatever the Trinamool can come with a defence, the, the fact of the matter is this incident has really uh, harmed the state of West Bengal as far as industrialization is concerned. And the fact is there is a lawlessness. There's not only that, there is an administrative terrorism. You, you go down to the rural areas, you will realize what is happening there. Above, on top of it, the, when you try to, uh, you know, uh, go to the uh, police or to the administrative bodies for protecting them, there, there are, you know, goons coming from the Trinamool uh, Congress, uh, the party members, they try to bully you and they, they throw you out. So there is enough which is happening and it has dampened the, you know, the spirit by, uh, under which the people of West Bengal wanted a change to come, uh, having seen 34 years of misrule of the, West, of the Communist Party. So there is nothing much which has changed and I am sorry to say, if this continues, the, uh, we are going to see West Bengal turning backwards or maybe behind what Lalu had produced Bihar as. I, and that is that, the reality in West Bengal today. That is a that is that is that is a, that is that is the bigger question tonight, isn't it? I mean, that's the question tonight. That is Haldia marking a return may, may, of may what I, happened with Tata in Singhu. May, may that I is actually no. the bigger question. You the know, difference you, is you, now Trinamool Congress is in government. The, the difference is you, you say the difference is now Trinamool Congress is in government, Mr. Mishra. Yes. The basic question is being evaded by Mr. Gupta. Basic question is that how come, even while the Honorable High Court has intervened, even while the company has paid for the police uh, protection, even while, uh, even while the work was getting affected, and how come that the executives have been abducted? That has not been answered. Not only that, we all know who are, is going to be the beneficiary. Let there be an inquiry. Why the Major Port Act of 1963 is not being made applicable? This has to be done by the central government. This has to be ensured by the state government. And how come that the state government has kept a silence? A, a silence which actually is trying to completely promote the vested interest of a private can, contractor can who any, are nothing but clearing and forwarding can any, can any more than, you raise the question of corporate the lobbies the question on the news are, however is can co more than corporate lobbies can the law of the land can the ruling of a, of a high court can the appeal of a corporate house that is invested can the abduction of a one year old child and three officials be considered a normal situation. That's the question tonight. Can Bengal afford another of repeat of Singhur four years later? Gentlemen, thank you very much for that debate. Thank you very much indeed.